what's up guys it's mystic and we're back with another video and for this one as you can see i'm right here oh man i'm right here and i'm playing gta on psp on my ipad and so that means you could be anywhere literally the last video we showed nintendo this video we're showing psp so i'm gonna show you guys exactly how you get this and i'm just showing you that everything works you know it's like i'm actually playing gta on a console um I'm actually walking around but anyway before we get into the video please just hit that subscribe button and let's get right into it all right so first thing I'm gonna have this link which is going to take you directly to the app store or you could go to the app store yourself and just search up this so it's called PP SSPP literally almost PSP so you just search that up and it's an app store this is completely on Apple's app store you just to download it and then once it's done, it open. And once you open it up, this is exactly what the app should look like. So it should look like an interface like this, and you're all set. So now I'm gonna show you guys how you can get games so you can actually play it. Otherwise, you're just gonna be staring at this. All right, so first things first, you're gonna have to get your ROM, which, I mean, if you own the game, hopefully you own these games that you're doing this with, or if you, you know, you could get it online. Uh, in my previous video, I showed you guys how you could get different games within Nintendo, so if you want to know how to download games, just check out that video. I have that linked here also, but pretty much you're gonna download a game or have your own PSP game, and then you're gonna get a zip file. Now with that zip file, I strongly encourage you to have like a folder with all your ROMs, whether it's just PSP only, Game Boy Advance, doesn't matter, just have a folder. And then once we're here, you're going to want to open up each one of these zip files. So once you open them up, it should become an ISO file. So all you literally do on here, on files, you just click on it, whether you're on phone or iPad, you'll click on the zip file and Apple will automatically open it. And once it opens it up, boom, see, look, I have an ISO file. So it has to be in this format. So once you have the ISO file, the next thing you're gonna to have to do is get familiar with how you can move this to the folders. So there's gonna be a PS, PPSSPP, which if you go to on my iPad or on my phone, it's gonna be a new folder that's there now, that's PPSSPP, all right? So I'm gonna favorite it so I can put it on my side so it's easier to get to. But now all you do is take your ISO file. So I'm gonna take these two that I got right here. I'm gonna select them, I'm gonna hit move, and then I'm gonna have to go to the game folders. So to do that, you go to the PPSSPP, then you go to PSP, then you go to game, and then that's it. So I bring both of those files into game, and boom, that's it. So all you guys gotta do every single time is just get your ISO file and move it to that game folder, and then that is literally it. So now I'm gonna show you guys exactly how it's gonna look. So you're gonna go to the app, and then now on this screen you go to games and boom it's going to show you the games that you just moved into that folder and now you have your own portable psp and just so you guys know you can basically take this anywhere and you don't need wi-fi because once you have it boom it works and then you can also connect any any type of controller whether it's a playstation controller whether it's an xbox controller you guys can connect any type of controller to it and i'm just showing you guys you know that it works this is an actual game that I just got, and as you can see, it's loading. I'm moving the analog stick, the button's working. I can start a new game right here, and that's pretty much it. So if you guys love this content, man, you want to keep seeing more videos like this, please subscribe, like it, and then comment. Tell me what you want to see, and I promise you I'll bring you guys some more stuff. I got a whole bunch more videos coming soon, and I promise you, you will not be disappointed. But hit the subscribe button so you'll definitely be notified when new videos are coming out. I mean, other than that, of course, appreciate you guys. And that's it for this video. Peace.